A rare moment in court today as a judge refused to go along with a plea deal, so now the case may head to trial. You say it's Byron Tollison here now to show us what happened. Brian, Letitia Gonzalez crashed her car into a pond near Holland last year. All three of her sons died. Earlier this year, she took a plea deal on operating while intoxicated charges. That plea deal with the prosecutor's office meant she wouldn't receive more than a year in jail. But the judge doesn't have to abide by that deal. Here's what happened in court in Grand Haven today. Would you like to say before sentence is imposed? No, I'm just willing to take my, you know, the consequences. Thank you. This plea agreement was taken under what was called a Killebrew plea. It's been memorialized in a court rule as well, and this court accepts a plea prior to reviewing the pre-sentence investigation report. So it's considered a tentative plea. After review of the pre-sentence report, the, the court cannot and will not follow the plea agreement. Rather, the court would impose a sentence of a prison sentence of 48 months to 180 months with a credit for 41 days previously served. However, the defendant does have the absolute right to withdraw the plea. Your Honor, at this point, at this time, we'd like to withdraw the plea. Plea is withdrawn. 